Chip Chesbro, Bobby Porter matchup, and it's going to be Chesbro, your winner once again. Here he is out of turn four. Chip Chesbro in the 33. Number 33, and he did it again. Entered the dash, won that. Entered the heat, won that. Entered the pursuit, and won that. Here he is from Broadview Heights, Ohio. Once again, how about a nice round of applause for Mr. Chip Chesbro. Sponsored tonight by Westside Metals and Chess Bros Unical 76. Number 33, the lady with the Michigan shirt going to Michigan University. Can you wave down there? The young gal at the grill, can you wave? Wave upstairs to the tower. Wave, you're on camera. Wave at the grill. Down, there you are. Thank you, honey. They pay off. Kevin Ruick has just given money to Joe. Isn't that special? Isn't that special? That's right, that's how we work things here. We take post-dated checks here at Lorraine Speedway for all payoffs. All right, and we're set for a grand total of 10 laps, and Bernie said, come on, come on, come on, look at Bernie, come on, come on, come on. Green flag, and we're off for 10 laps. holding his own nicely, but it looks like no more as we got a dog race on our hands. Check this out. Coming up out of turn four, the mini stock pursuit. And the number seven, the number 98 automobile off the speedway, and we have a tangle in turn number one and two. A tangle is there. This may force the yellow, and it does. The yellow flag is out. The yellow flag comes out, the number 98 automobile now sitting uh, idle in turn one and two. But he went to wave to our camera people there. Hello to you and welcome Dave, our cameraman. Dave, if we could get a shot of you, we certainly would, uh, but we can't. As we could have some slipping and sliding and some mishaps galore. Green flag is out, we're back under the green and the mini stock pursuit is underway. Again, hello tonight to our fans watching at home, courtesy of Images to Remember. Number 17, B&B Beverage Automobile, Fred Hall. He's pushing himself hard in the lead. The 42 is there in second spot. Number 14 is dropping behind. I think the 14 could be bounced out of this event, maybe in a minute. We'll see, here they are to turn four. 17, B&B Beverage Automobile up front. goes here tonight at Lorraine Speedway, the mini stock pursuit, turning into a real battle here. Fred Hall is holding on the 42. 42 tonight is Bill Haynes from Cincinnati, Ohio. Both of our lead automobiles hail from Hamilton County, Cincinnati. And the 70 is closing in on both automobiles, and here we are to turn four. The lead still being held. And trouble in turn number one and two. We'll zero in on that. The number 91 is there. Up against the wall, and the yellow flag is out. Scott Hall involved there up against the rail, rather. The number 91, Scott Hall from Dayton, Ohio, is involved. A second automobile is involved as well. The yellow flag is out. Uh, Mike downstairs in intermission or Mike downstairs uh, at the concession intermission will be forthcoming in one more race. We always like to tell Mike so he has enough hot dogs ready down there. Intermissions in one more race, Mike, after this one. All right. And now we are coming up out of turn four and the green flag is up. Fred Hall is back into the lead, but we got some activity brewing for second spot. The number 70 
Little Bill about to overtake second, and I think he does. Yes, here is the kill out of turn four. Fred Hall is very comfortable, uh, comfortable shape. Carol Hargis from Mason, Ohio, holding on now to second spot. And from there, we go to third spot, number 61. Number 61 automobile in third at the moment is none other than Pat Turner from Cincinnati. Pat Turner is in third, and we're coming up out of turn four. Still Fred Hall. and not making much of an effort at the moment. I don't think he will surpass the leader. It might be too early to tell that the Hargis Automobile, about two car lengths, now one car length, at least going into these turns, and Hargis is closing in. We got one lap to go, one lap yet to go, as the 17 BA BV Automobile, BV Beverage Sponsored Automobile, Holding on to late, and I think Fred Hall will win his second event here tonight at Lorraine Speedway. This is our second evening of 1990. The season is ever so young. Here we are, and the green flag is out. Turns to checker, and it belongs to the number 17 automobile, Mr. Fred Hall. Fred Hall has some momentum, and I think that he may be in that number 17, B and V Beverage Automobile, he may be an odds-on favorite for a 25-lap feature win tonight. As you saw about 40 minutes ago, he won his heat. He's back to win his pursuit. You can't miss that sponsor. If you're plugging a sponsor, that's how you do it. Look at the car, B and V, as clear as day. Number 17 from Cincinnati. How about a nice round of applause for Fred Hall. All right, Johnny Carr is starting things off in the 60. Johnny Carr, Frank Volk right behind. And now the green flag is out. You're on your own now, drivers. Bernie Boo says you're on your own. And right now we've got Ed Curtis locked in a bitter battle for third at the moment. And Ed Curtis is dropping. Ed Curtis could be out of it. We may have suffered a loss early, but Curtis has seemed to regain. We got a spin out, both in the 93. But the race goes on. The race goes on as Johnny Carr in the 60. Holding on to the lead, Johnny Carr in the number 60. And Ed Curtis in the number 73. The battle is in fact for second spot at the moment. Johnny Carr still holding on to the lead. Johnny Carr into the lead. Ed Curtis in 73, now moving into second spot. Curtis in 73, and the number 02 is making his presence known, but Curtis may have him beat. Let's watch this turn four. all filing up out of turn two, Johnny Carr, Curtis, and the number zero two, Junior Boy Gherkin, is in the third spot. Jimmy Franco, unofficially, is in four. Here they are to turn four, the number 60, Johnny Carr holding on. Johnny Carr holding on to the lead, number 60, Ed Curtis in 73. Zero two, and Franco holding on. Got a battle for a last spot brewing at the moment. Reedy and Bud Wise involved in some battle. And there we have the automobiles filing on by. Starter Bernie Booth as they enter turn 
two, now entering the back straightaway. Johnny Carr could pick up his first win of 1990 here at Lorraine Speedway. This will be his first win if he does it, and Ed Curtis is still holding on to second spot. The 0 2 is in third at the moment. The 0 2 automobile still holding on to third. And Jimmy Franco in the 12 is in fourth. And Carr goes high, and Curtis takes over. And Curtis, maybe one lap to go. One lap yet to go. One lap to go. One lap to go. And now we have the number 73 holding on to the lead. Watch this finish. Watch this finish. Here they are to turn four, and we're coming up out of turn four. It's going to be coming up out of the turn. And your winner at the end of 10 laps there, the number 73, Ed Curtis. Ed Curtis in 73 is your winner. He takes in the final seconds there. Johnny Carr in the 60 must settle for second spot. And here he is, the numbers in there, probably talking to each other, and I don't know what kind of looks they're giving each other right now coming out of that turn, but it ain't pleasant. Here he is, the number 73 from Brook Park, Ohio. How about a nice round of applause for Ed Curtis. Ed Curtis is 73 and a very nicely done job. And look at the automobile, isn't that sharp? Sponsored by Almira Tire and uh, Hudak Racing. The There's only 10 here. 25 laps to go, we'll see what uh, Bernie Booth does. I think he may drop the white, yeah, white flag is out. You know, we were talking about earlier Memorial Day weekend and who we need to remember and what have you, and please do that this weekend. Fly the Stars and Stripes, will you please? Get them out. You got them up in the closet, the flag. Get it out and fly it this weekend. Please do that. That is the number 12 automobile, Ray Bolin on the pole. 76 automobile, Mr. Deegan off the pole. And then we move along. Then we move along to the number 60, Tony DiPaolo from Bedford, Ohio. John Sandquist in the number 66. Paul Atkins in 25. Dan Villers, 84. 25 laps to go. Oh, my complete restart. No major damage. No major damage, complete restart in the event. Number 76 is tied up. Position now. 